What's up YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at our community combo video, part 62. Now, in these videos, I do get combos from the comments below and I do showcase them for you guys. If you guys wanna be part of my next community combo video, just leave your combinations in the comments below. Now, each week I do pick one lucky winner to actually get some V-Bucks for having the best combo throughout the week. So without further ado guys, let's get these combos started. Now for our first combination entry, we do have the entry from Star Set for Life. Now Star Set for Life, they do go with Rook, then for the back name of choice being Course Toolkit. Now the Course Toolkit and uh, Rook look amazing together. The color scheme of black and red really do highlight each other's color schemes and it looks something that Rook would actually use as a backlink. Then for the harvesting tool, they do go with the crowbar. Now the crowbar itself is a universal harvesting tool. It does have a simple design, it actually looks very decent with Rook, especially because it does have that black and silver. Then for the control, they do go with the getaway case. Now the getaway case itself is just a briefcase handcuffed to your arm. Now Rook actually does look like she actually works in the office, so it makes perfect sense for her to have a briefcase. Then for the glad, we are going to be going with the best car umbrella. Now the best car umbrella, even though it does have silver and black, it matches really well. The black design and silver goes really well with the glider and harvesting tool they are picking. And then for the wrap, they are going to be going with Hunter's Arsenal. Now the Hunter's Arsenal wrap itself matches really well. Now the wrap itself is reactive each time you do shoot, those little red lights do get brighter and brighter and it matches perfectly. Then for our next combination entry, we do have the entry from Chris Franco. Now Chris Franco does go with the skin jawbreaker, then for the back name of choice, they do go with the dark paradigm. Now if you actually look closely, the digital camo that the Dark Paradigm actually does have does go really well with the shorts and socks. Now this combination of black and white actually goes really well because again the shorts and socks. Then for the harvesting tool, they are going to be going with the burning fangs. Now the burning fangs itself, you could have taken it right out in the crew pack. The simple design of pink and black goes really well together. Then for the control, they are going to be going with the rift lining. Now the rift lining itself goes really well with this combination just cause the outfit itself even though it's not very highlighted, she does have pink. Then for the glider, we're gonna be going with the cat wing. Now the cat wing glider itself does have an all black finish, it does have the thrusters being pinkish purple which goes really well with the skin. Then for the wrap, we're gonna be going with the snug shine. Now the snug shine itself is a reactive wrap or animated that does have a pink and black and gray design. It goes really well with the outfit and backlink and harvesting tool combination. Then for next combination entry, we're going to be going with FN Andre. Now the FN Andre skin combo, he does go with Charlotte with the first style. Then for the back name of choice, he does go with the cutter ball. Now even though this combination is very simple, it's effective. The cutter ball itself actually does match really well because it does have like this very like vibrant black color scheme that goes really well with the edging from the skirt. And then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the graffiti axe. Now the graffiti axe itself, even though it's not a completely all black wrap, it still matches really well with the outfit. Then for the control, we're going to be going to Spectral Lessons. Again, this whole combination is very simplistic but effective. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the one-shot. Now the one-shot glider itself does have a matte black finish, it's very simple, but again, like I mentioned previously, effective in this combination. Then for the wrap, we're going to be going to Shadow Seal. Now the Shadow Seal wrap itself is not the best black wrap out there, but it still looks very clean. It does have a darker and brighter black color scheme that goes really well with the skirt that Charlotte does have. Then for our next combination entry, we do have the entry from Davy Life. Now Davy Life itself does go with the skin, the Molten Ragnarok. Then for the back name choice, they do go with the Spectral Spine with the orange color scheme. Now they do mention that they're going for a molding combo and I couldn't agree more. The Spectral Spine itself matches perfectly with Ragnarok. Then for the harvesting tool, they are going to be going with the Soul Fire Chain. Now the Soul Fire Chain is an amazing choice for a harvesting tool. The chains themselves having the flame in the end of it just goes really well and very logically with the Molten Ragnarok. Then for the Contra, they're going to be going with the Lava. Now again, another excellent choice. The Lava Contra actually fits really well with this combination. Then for the Glider, they are going to be going with the Astro World Cyclone. Now the only issue I do have with this combination, the Astro World Cyclone, even though it does have the tracks being fired, it still would have been better to actually use another Glider, but it still looks decent. Then for the Wrap, we're going to be going with the Frangles. The Frangles Wrap is very universal with Molten Skins and the Molten Ragnarok is no exception. Then for our next combination entry, we do have the entry from Sans Sans Life. Sorry if I did butcher the name. Now he is going to be going with the Ninja Turtle combo, which he does go with the skin hybrid with the stage 3 with the red arm and then the green color tone. Then for the back name choice, he does go with Shelly with the green color scheme. Now this combination actually he gravitated towards me perfectly. I do like the skin combination and I do like the design. The whole dragon theme with the shell just goes perfectly. Then for the harvesting tool, they're going to be going with the Scarlet Sai. 
Now the Scarlet Psy itself or the Psy themselves does represent really well the Ninja Turtle, especially with Raphael. They are using a red color scheme with the hybrid skin so it makes sense for them to go with this harvesting tool. Then for the control, we can be going with the Retro Sci-Fi. Now again, another excellent choice for control. The Retro Sci-Fi could have been that goo that actually gave the turtles their power and it just reflected with the control. Then for the glider, they do go with the extra cheese. Now the extra cheese itself is self-explanatory. The Ninja Turtles themselves do love cheese pizza and just having this as a glider just made excellent, again, excellent choice. Then for the wrap, the car is going to be going with the Arcane Steel. Now the Arcane Steel is not my favorite wrap out there, but it makes sense. The green and silver design of it just looks amazing and then each time you do shoot your weapon it does light up so it makes perfect sense for them to have this as a wrap. Then for our last combination entry we do have the entry from the real Gabe Newells. Now he does go with the combo of black card with the stage 5 with the white curse scheme. Then for the back name choice he does go with the chimera plasma pack again with the armor lunar and the armor curse scheme of it being a 488 min. Now, I am getting tired of people actually using the Chimera Plasma Pack for a lot of combos, but this one was the exception. The Chimera Plasma Pack just fits really well and he actually did an amazing choice pairing them together. Then for the Harvesting Tool, he does go with the Demon Slayer Blade. Now the Demon Slayer Blade itself is the Harvesting Tool you could obtain right now. He did go with the Demon Fire for the Blade itself since it does have like that turquoise green curse scheme that is identical to that of the Chimera Pack and the glow he does have inside his body. Then for the control, he does go with the Conduit Crasher. Now the Conduit Crasher again is an excellent choice for a control. The design of it just goes really well with the like flame from inside his body and the Chimera's Plasma Pack's laser. Then for the glider, he does go with the Whale Sailor with the Ghoulish Green Edistyle. Now again, he's just pairing up all these things that actually make perfect sense. The Whale itself is from the ocean so it could have made perfect sense for the skin itself, Black Card to actually ride or actually die by it. Then for the wrap, he does go with the Falling Soul. Now I did look everywhere and I'm pretty sure he meant the falling snow and if he did it's an excellent choice. The details of the wrap itself just goes perfectly with the outfit and even the snow just goes really well with again the curse scheme of the skin and backlink. Now for my favorite choice of the week I'm just gonna have to give it to the real Gabe Niwa. Now it was a close call between the Ninja Turtle combo and his and after it just admit his combo just blew me out of the water. Now he did use black card which a lot of people don't use, he did use other items that were just introduced into this season so to actually for him to make this combo so fast with the new items was just a masterpiece. Now just message me with your social media link in the comments below. Now if you guys want to be part of my next community combo video just leave your combinations in the comments below as well. And for all my social media in discord they'll be in the description. And if you guys want to support the channel, my code is Enigma Kid, all caps, two D's, all together. Each time you guys use my code near the item shop or the Epic Game Store, I do get a small percentage of it, and it really helps this channel grow. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.